What's going on, my pretty healthcare brothers and sisters? I hope that you are having a wonderful day. We're continuing on in the ATIT's question review series, and today we're gonna to be discussing bodily organs and systems. Which of the following is a correct example of a part of the appendicular skeleton? Is it A, the cranium, B, the rib cages, C, legs, or D, spinal cord? And the correct answer is C, legs. The appendicular portion of the body includes the limbs, which are the arms and the legs. The cranium, rib cage, and spinal cord are all part of the axial portion of the body. Blank are chemical messengers produced by the endocrine glands. Which of the following best completes the sentence above? Is it A, hormones, B, sperm cells, C, white blood cells, or D, antigens? And the correct answer is A, hormones. Hormones are the chemical messengers produced by the endocrine glands. Hormones are used to regulate many bodily activities. Sperm is produced by the testes for reproduction. White blood cells are used to protect the body against pathogens. And antigens are foreign cells recognized by the immune system. Which of the following is not a body part involved in the respiratory system? Is it A, trachea? B, lungs, C, bronchial tree, or D, ovaries? I think this one was a little bit easy. The correct answer is D, ovaries. The ovaries are a part of the female reproductive system. The trachea, lungs, and bronchial tree are all part of the respiratory system. Which of the following is a function performed primarily by the kidneys? Is it A, to remove metabolic waste? B, pump blood, C, produce sperm, or D, secrete sweat? And the correct answer is A, remove metabolic waste. One of the functions of the kidneys is to remove metabolic waste, and they also produce urine. The heart pumps blood, the testes produce sperm, and the glands in the skin secrete sweat. If a female egg is not fertilized, what happens to the egg during the menstruation cycle? Is it A, it remains in the uterus, B, it is discharged during menstruation, C, it fuses together with sperm, or D, it travels back to the ovaries? And the correct answer is B, it is discharged during menstruation. If an egg or ovum is not fertilized, then it is discharged during menstruation. If the egg is fertilized, it is fused with the sperm and remains in the uterus to develop during pregnancy. The egg does not travel back up to the ovaries. If you're reviewing the posterior of a skeleton, you are seeing which side. Is it A, the front, B, the back, C, the side, or D, the top? And the correct answer is B, the back. If you're reviewing the posterior of a skeleton, then you are looking at the back. The term anterior refers to the front of the skeleton. What is a possible situation in which an autoimmune disease could develop? Is it A, the immune system attacks the body's own cells? B, a person has a cold or flu? C, antibodies develop against a pathogen? Or D, the spleen functions normally. And the correct answer is A, the immune system attacks the body's own cells. The autoimmune disease results when the body attacks its own cells. If a person has a cold or flu, the immune system is fighting foreign pathogens. Antibodies develop against pathogens that would be normal in the immune response. And the spleen filters blood and is not a vital organ. The blank plane divides the body into right and left parts. Which of the following best completes the sentence above? Is it A, axial, B, appendicular, C, frontal, or D, sagittal? And the correct answer is D, sagittal. The sagittal plane divides the body into right and left parts. The axial portion of the body consists of the head, neck, and torso. The appendicular portion of the body consists of the limbs, and the frontal plane divides the body into anterior and posterior parts. Which is the main function of the nervous system? Is it A, it regulates the body's movements, 
B, it maintains homeostasis in the body. C, it breaks down the food we eat through digestion. Or D, it coordinates the body's responses to different stimuli. And the correct answer is D, it coordinates the body's responses to different stimuli. The main function of the nervous system is to coordinate the body's responses to different stimuli. It acts as a regulator for the body by responding to stimuli through their receptors. The muscular system regulates the body's movements, the endocrine system maintains homeostasis, and the digestive system breaks down the fat in the food we eat. So therefore, choices A, B, and C would be incorrect. Moving on to our last question. The right atrium in the heart receives what kind of blood? Is it A, oxygen-rich blood from the left ventricle, B, oxygen-poor blood from the tissues, C, oxygen-rich blood from the right ventricle, or D, oxygen-poor blood from the left atrium? And the correct answer is B, oxygen-poor blood from the tissues. The right atrium receives oxygen-poor blood from the tissues. It is the first of the four chambers to receive blood from the body. After the blood leaves the right atrium, it travels to the right ventricle and to the lungs and so on, until it leaves the heart through the systemic circulation and travels through the body. I hope that these question review series are helpful in helping you pass the ATITs like a boss. Make sure that you follow me on my social media. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, and of course here on YouTube. Make sure that you subscribe. And I highly recommend that you check out my website at nursechung.com where I have additional practice questions to help you get a little bit further in your studies. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down below. I love answering them. And until next time, I hope that y'all have a wonderful day and I will see you all again soon. Bye.